Okay, here we go again for the second time. Um, so yeah, I, like I said, the friend that taught me a few days ago, her name is Annie. And I ain't spoken to Annie for almost a year. We spoke last year, we had a bit of a falling out. And uh, we, we, we were friends. Uh, 2019 rolls up. We haven't spoken to each other for a long time. And just last week, she sends me a message saying, Hey, it's been a while. We haven't talked. Uh, I just want to talk. Now, she spammed the message to me, and I was asleep. And her second message goes like this: it "Goes, um, um, I'm sorry for what I did." So she goes. Um, I'm sorry, did you not hear what I said? I said, I'm sorry for what I did. And then it gets into dark territory. And she goes, listen, if you don't talk to me, if you don't stop with me and talk to me, I'm going to do what I did last year to you, and I'm going to have you, I'm going to purposely get you banned yet again. Like I did last year. You're the reason why I got you purposely banned on your account. And I, at that point, I was like, oh, this girl means business. She's serious. So I finally tried to get, I finally got to talk to her. I had to send probably 16 messages before I actually got through. I says, um, Annie, I don't know why you're so upset with me. I don't know what your problem is. I don't even know who you are. I was like completely why this girl that I don't know or A or B haven't spoken to for such a long time was so mad at me. She goes, Oh, I'm mad at you because you don't mention me. I says, I was sleeping. I just got the messages. Now I've told you my last name. I hate people sending me messages when I'm sleeping. Especially when you're a person that spams messages like crazy like where are you? What are you doing kind of thing? Where I am is sleeping when I'm my doing off with sleeping. People forget that when you're in a different time zone, you're not gonna up in the morning when you're up in the morning. It's a completely different time. And I explain this to her nicely. She goes, You owe me some money. I says, What are you talking about? What do you I make a joke saying, What are you, the mafia? What do you mean I owe you some money? You owe me a hundred dollars. I says, I don't owe you anything. She goes, okay, so then she tries to handle me. She goes, okay, let's make it 30. I says, no. Well, she goes, okay, well, give me your credit card number. I says, I says, Annie, you are not allowed to give that information out on the PlayStation Network. It's against the rules. Everybody knows this. Well, she goes, well, you're going to give me something for my troubles. I was like, what are you talking about? What, why are you so mad at me? What do you want out of this? What are you trying to do? So she explains to me, well, I'm a computer hacker. I don't care. I never care about our friendship. I only want the money. After you give me the money, I will leave you alone. So she goes down to the territory of blackmail. So I talked to her. I really did try to talk to her. I tried to be her friend. I tried to, you know, understand what the real problem was. I tried to point her in the right direction. She goes, and she started kissing me out, and I'm not going to she said, she was hell with you, you know, I don't need your friends, if I never did, and stop trying to hang with me out of my money, you know, I don't own you anything, I don't know you, 